Welcome to mechanical tutorial. I am going to teach you different techniques in SOLIDWORKS for mechanical engineers. I am going to train you different modules like surface modeling, sheet metal and enclosure design, product design, plastic components design, reverse engineering and many more tips and tricks in SOLIDWORKS. Hi, today I am going to explain how to create honeycomb pattern on cylindrical component in sheet metal see this is the component I am going to create with honeycomb structure so let's start now I have taken a new SOLIDWORKS part file select the top plane go to sketch select a circle so diameter is 70 next to draw one center line simply place it and make it horizontal now draw one more center line and just place it here on the circle so make sure that it is coincide with this circle now mirror the center line make say ok now dimension this so I'm taking point 1 should be very much closer should resemble like a circle now this area we need to trim see this so sketch is fully constrained and there is a small gap now go to sheet metal module select the base flange so height I have taken 40 and say ok so this is the cylindrical tube or cylindrical component see here when we make the flat pattern it looks like this so uncheck the flat pattern now I am going to create hexagonal cutout on the front plane so keep it in wireframe now select the polygon with the six faces and place it like this and make sure that this is vertical and the distance between these two lines is 6 mm and from origin to this place center line center point is 7 now select the center mark and origin and make it vertical see here and go to sheet metal and select extruded cut and select through all see here and say ok see so the cut has formed in both the directions
now select the top line go to sketch draw a center line vertically so you can coincide to one of the edge and draw one more center line make it inclined and uh, this angle is 8.18 say ok so to view the sketch show hide options so the sketch is visible now now make a plane select this line should be inclined line see here it is inclined and second reference select this point so this is the plane so select this option to see this plane now select this plane go to sketch and select the polygon place it like this so this is a 6 mm this is 12 select this and this it is vertical so select this one of the edge make it vertical so it is constrained now and go to sheet metal and select extruded and through all both sides see here now go to linear pattern so before creating this we have to create one axis so select axis and select this face see here now go to linear pattern select this axis and three instances so features we have to select these two so it is in opposite direction so flip the direction see from the front view see this is and save it. now I am going to make a circular pattern so go to circular pattern select this axis and make it 22 instances and say ok so this is the final hexagonal pattern I am going to hide axis and plane see here So I am going to show you flat pattern
see here this is the pattern so this is how we create uh, this kind of pattern on cylindrical components thanks for watching